Hey, it's me, GV, and welcome to another Shrine Guide for The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be the Kikakin Shrine Shining in Darkness Guide, and this one is located all the way north of central Hyrule, right around here, as you can see. Uh, this one is very unique, and you'll see why as soon as we enter it. Uh, we're going to show you how to get all the chests, of which there is like around five in this one. This one has a lot of chests. As you can see here, yes, it's unique because it is completely pitch black. Um, the big tip for this one is to use the uh, seeds. I forget what they called, but the I forget what they're called, but the seeds that show you um, how to navigate in darkness. Um, so we're gonna just move forward here a little bit. You can also just use the light as well. Hi, little kitty. Um, so we're gonna hug to the left mainly. And uh, we'll show you all the different chest locations. Um, but you can also use this uh, Zonai device as well to light your way. So there's one chest here which has an opal right about there. And then there's a dead end over here. Uh, bright bloom seeds are what they're called. Yeah, so I know my way around this so I can kind of navigate it. But you can also throw bright bloom seeds to light up the entire map as well. That's another strategy to do this. Uh, we're going to go this way, and then we're going to turn this way. And here's the one that got me stuck for the longest time. And I'll show you now uh, that we're going to go ahead and use Bright Bloom Seeds. Just got to find them. They're like way deep into my way deep into my list of uh, materials, I think. But yeah, you have the normal Bright Bloom Seeds, and then you have the big bright bloom seeds right around here so we're going to take a giant bright bloom seed and we are going to take our bow and then attach this and shoot it right around there and you can see that lights up the place really nicely so that's the number one tip is to use the bright bloom, bright bloom seeds obviously but you can also get by just by using this but here's the chest that got me stuck for the longest time this one up here so we're going to use ascend to go up top here and then pop out and uh, you'll be able to get something here I forget, there's so many chests in this one that I forget what they all have but here's one right there there's also this little alcove which is really interesting um, you don't have to use this to navigate anywhere but it does go out here it's kind of weird I'm not sure what this exactly is for but you can see some other stuff down there I guess it's just to navigate uh, in a little bit of a different way if you so wish but we're gonna head back down and grab this light again and keep going I think we still have two to three other chests to grab there's so many in this one so we're gonna keep going this way and here there is a movable floor tile where there will be another chest hiding right down there so we're gonna grab that and we're gonna keep going this way let's make a left turn up here yeah if you have the smaller bright bloom seeds you can throw them willy-nilly hit them and then just light up the entire zone basically uh, we're gonna go back over this way where there is going to be yet another chest right there and then yeah so the big tip for this one as well is to just keep hugging to the left basically and then um, yeah you don't you don't want to go to the right you want to go to the left and then that'll basically get you all the chests there's another movable wall tile here where we can uh, push this up against the wall and then climb it to get up here and grab yet another chest and then we're going to keep moving this way. And I think that might be all the chests. There may be one more. Yeah, I believe that is all the chests in this particular one. Uh, one of those chests is going to have the small key, which will open up this door. And then you can simply go through and finish the shrine. So there we go. If you found this guide helpful slash, enter slash entertaining, consider leaving a like and a comment and subscribing. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.